So John Cena in that suit might be a pretty tough act to follow, but we might just have it in the bag. The Cape Town International Film Market and Festival kicked off to much success last year and is returning in 2018 to provide opportunities to see the best in local and international film, as well as provide a space for business-to-business -business interactions among industry professionals. This is essential for our industry to grow. And this morning, we are being joined by the marketing director, Elias Ribeiro and Jehad Kasu, to chat a little bit more about um, what must feel like a baby that you guys have released into the world. Congratulations on the success of last year. You guys are doing something so important, and you're part of, hopefully, a shift in perceptions. Maybe, Jihad, I can start with you. Based on what you've seen, the shift in focus, the change that you're trying to bring about, what have you seen change with regards to filmmakers, with film goers, and most important, importantly, I think, the market buyers and sellers where we really need to stimulate the industry? What shifts have you seen? Thank you for that, uh, Graeme. I think um, it's important for us to realize that ever since the success of Black Panther, there's been uh, an increased demand for Afrocentric content. And uh, that's key to the business side of film uh, within Africa. I think we are trying to uh, propel the, the value of African content beyond uh, our own borders. Um, it is uh, particularly essential to the success of our industries. And we want to make our film producers and uh, film creators understand that there is value in there. It's accessing platforms such as ours that bridges the gap between buyer and seller that uh, enables the success and sustainability of the industries. So I think that's the big wake-up call. You think you've got the most amazing script or this incredible story to tell or the material and you forget that it is still a business. We need to buy, sell and create demand in that space. And we know we've got the viewership now, um, certainly here in Africa, and we are finally supporting our own films. But from your perspective, from your very um, kind of key viewpoint, why is it so important for filmmakers to engage with an organization with a festival like yours? So we want to be a space to foster development of African content and my job is to try and bring creatives, ideas together with the money that can facilitate the making of those ideas. That's what a film market is there for. Uh, this year we are launching a program called Works in Progress where films that are in the making will be uh, screened to an, an audience of international stakeholders. Between them, there will be festival programmers from the big festivals of the world, uh, talent agents, as well as sales companies that work and understand Africa. Uh, we're curating a program of six films from all over the continent, and this will be the content that will attract the international uh, stakeholders should come to our The money. Yeah. Yes. The money. <laughs> and, and because the, the film industry in South Africa is relatively small compared to other parts of the world, uh, creating access to foreign markets is particularly valuable to a South African or African filmmaker. And one of the key benefits um, is that next year we are taking five films to the Beijing International Film Festival. So these are the particular opportunities that we've uh, created within this platform and hope to grow as we move forward uh, to create better economic opportunities for our local filmmakers. Now, I'm, I'm sorry to cut you off there. I just, uh, for me, the, uh, we know that we make good content, but the process always seems to fall down at a point. Why are you guys doing this? What was the, the, the kind of conditions in the market? What prompted you to say, okay, we need to support the Western Cape. Obviously, this is very much focused here, but also just give South African film this international connection. Is it just about making money? Because that's fine if everyone is mm. going to make money, but what motivated you? Uh, I think uh, our chairman, uh, Rafik Samson, is particularly passionate about this industry. Uh, he's a veteran, he's an Oscar-nominated producer-director, and uh, he really wants to see this industry thrive. He's someone that started at the bottom um, and has reached the peak that he has, and he really wants to see the industry transformed at the same time. So transformation is one of the key uh, pillars of the business. Um, and. I think now government departments, uh, particularly in the Western Cape, have realized that the film industry is one of the key catalysts for job creation and economic growth. Um, and it's as big and as important as mining, agriculture, and aquaculture, for example. And now that uh, government is understanding the potential that it has, they are leading their support towards us, uh, particularly the city of Cape Town. And uh, being here just helps us market this event internationally because Cape Town in itself is such a strong asset. And uh, we are aligning with the city of Cape Town in that regard to ensure that uh, we leverage 
as best as possible. Yeah, we've got the perfect conditions to film down here as well. Um, sorry, we've run out of time, but just very quickly, I know submissions have reopened for a brief window. How can people connect with you very quickly? We're going to have the details, but um, how do we fast track the process? Uh, well, they're open until the 17th this Friday, so if there's any filmmakers out there watching the show, please send us your works in progress for consideration. And you can e email Zahra at filmfast.capetown. All the best of luck with your future endeavours. Very exciting space to watch. Cape Town International Film Market and Festival takes place from the 9th to the 19th of October. Various venues at the V&A Waterfront. The deadline for those film submissions, as you've just heard, has been extended. So if you'd like to enter your product, then make sure you head over to filmfestival.capetown for more information. Get on this train now. It's about to leave the station.